Hey guys and welcome back and you may be wondering why I have Alphamon up on tcgplayer.com that's currently worth $13 well you may not be wondering because you probably read the title of this video and that's why you're here so I woke up today to some very 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 amazing news and that was a post made by Digimon TCG which was now 56 minutes ago and they they're finally they finally dropped Alphamon or Yukin. And what a beautiful card for one. Level 7 secret rare pull from BT9. DP of 16,000 K, which is very high. There's not that many cards that are 16 if any. No, it's usually 15 for level 7. So this is 16k DP and my oh my let's get right into it so translation evolves from alphamon and oryumon in its evolution source for three cost now this is totally doable because the whole x antibody gimmick at least for alphamon you're able to put cards from your hand to its evolution source if it has x antibody so that's how you're able to have you know, you're able to put an Alphamon or an Oryumon and therefore having two level sixes. So that's what's going to trigger when you evolve into this level seven Alphamon, costing three cost. Now, second is when evolved, delete all your opponent's Digimon with the highest play cost. Pretty good effect, especially if you're trying to get rid of a level seven that's on the board and you know you can't swing over it. Not only that, you digivolve into this uh, Alpha Mon or Yumon. You don't have to waste your swing at a high cost Digimon, if that makes sense. You could save that swing for potentially winning the game or just going into security. Anyway, moving on. The best part of this card, in my opinion, is once per turn at the end of your turn, by returning up to seven non Digimon cards non digitama cards in this Digimon's evolution sources with X anybody type to the bottom of your deck for each card removed or return to the bottom of your deck gain plus one memory now I mentioned that that X anybody for Alphamon in the later sets which I believe is eight seven definitely not seven eight I stated that you know their effects help each other you know build up their their evolution stack so now you can see how this alpha mon or yukin or yukin is gonna be a really good card card mid to end of the of the game just because you're gonna build up your stack and you're gonna have a pretty hefty stack and using this guy's effect you can get up to love uh level i was about to say level seven you can get up to seven memory depending on how many cards you remove from your stack and put them back in your deck so not only are you putting cards back into your deck therefore you potentially getting those cards again and using them again you're also getting memory back at the end of your turn so now you attack, let's say you clear board, you attack, you end your turn, and let's say they end the three, just because that's a tamer effect, put them at three. Now Alphamon's effect is going to activate, and even if you have five, you're going to get five memory back. That's going to go back to your turn now. And now if you wanted to play something else that you couldn't play, well, here you go. Now you can play it. And not only that, it doesn't... What I like about this is it just says end of your turn. It's not like the regular alpha mod when it says when attacking. So you can play all the cards you need to play to set yourself up. And if that ends your turn, now this effect is going to play. And potentially now you can, it can go back to your turn and now you can swing so really really great card and i think this is really going to boost the black black color in the meta and it's just going to be awesome and the reason i have alphamon up again in tcg player is so you guys can get a playset before this price 
goes back up. Thirteen dollars from what was it like forty bucks from when it first came out is pretty cheap. And Alphamon has been a card that a lot of people have been waiting for. And with Oryuken coming, this price will skyrocket back up. So make sure you get a playset while you can. And this, I believe this is another reason. It was stated in the Digimon uh, TCG, not in the Digimon TCG uh, website, of why this um mega digimon fusion card was banned and that's because of susanomon right he's coming out i believe in bt7 and susanomon another level seven you're able to go from it from a tamer if you meet its requirements for zero cost if you use mega digimon fusion so yes although the site states that you know they saw susanomon and that's really why they chose to ban it. This is another reason why. Because <laughs> now if you, if you were to use this on or you can alpha Mon, instead of costing three or seven, you're going to play it for free. And then once he turns over, even though he leaves the field, now you're going to gain uh, the memory back if it were to work. If it were to work that, that yeah, it would work that way because it's the end of your turn. And uh, me uh, Mega Digimon Fusion, it's after your turn's over. Yep, at the end of your turn. Oh, yeah, you can choose to resolve the effects how you choose. So, see, there you go. So another reason why Mega Digimon Fusion has been banned, which I, I agree with, is you have Cri Crimson Gallimon coming out. You have uh, Bialzamon level 7 now, which is, uh, I believe it's a uh, Blast Mode, Burst Mode. And then you have potentially all these new... Burst modes that are going to come out. What about when uh, Shine, Shine Burst comes out? Uh, Burst Mega Gargomon. You know, all these cards are going to be level 7. This kind of makes sense. Not kind of. It really does make sense why they chose to ban Dig uh, Digimon Fusion. So, yeah. Again, beautiful card. Alpha Mon or Yoken. And, uh... Please pick up a playset of Alpha One if you do not have one. This is a new type of video that I'm making, and I'm really gonna do a podcast, more so a little series. I really don't want to focus on cards that are coming out, just because I'm impatient. I want the cards now, <laughs> and they're not gonna come out for months and months from now. But with this video, I mean, I'm like, hey, you know what? This is Alpha Man. I love Alpha Man. And I know a lot of people are looking forward to this. I was up and this came out about an hour ago. So I'm like, you know what? Let's just do it. And that's pretty much it. So there you go, guys. Alpha Mon or Yoken level 7. If you guys like this type of video, don't forget to uh, like it and subscribe so you guys can... Uh, so I can do more videos like this if you guys actually like more reveals. But uh, again, I'm just looking forward to making podcasts, making some Digimon battles and some uh, just... Digimon, everything really. So there you go, guys. I will see you guys in the next video.